In November 2021, you may have heard of a Windows installer vulnerability that enabled cybercriminals to elevate their privileges and spread within a network. You may have also done your due diligence and addressed this vulnerability on your devices. But what if you're responsible for hundreds of endpoints? This is where vulnerability assessment can help. Vulnerability assessment is a new feature you can add on to your customer site's subscriptions. In a nutshell, vulnerability assessment allows you to check for common vulnerabilities and exposures, or CVEs, across all of your endpoints. CVEs are like unsecured doors that enable attackers to access your endpoints and perform malicious activities. However, with vulnerability assessment, you can address these vulnerabilities and exposures to secure your endpoints and data better. After adding on vulnerability assessment to your entitlement, you can add vulnerability assessment subscriptions to your sites. First, select the site. Open the drop-down menu on the top right. Click on Manage Subscription, and then Next. On the Add-ons tab, enable Vulnerability Assessment. Next, choose to specify a number of endpoints to allocate. This number is only used for over-deployment notifications. For example, if you allocate 10 endpoints here and later deploy vulnerability assessment to 15 endpoints under this site, you will receive a notification letting you know that you overdeployed. Check the box to agree to the monthly charges you will incur from deploying this add-on to the site's endpoints. Then click Save. With this entitlement, you can also see we have access to three new widgets. To use vulnerability assessment, we first need to assign it to your endpoints. First, go to Policies and select the policy you wish to add vulnerability assessment to. In this video, we will use the default policy. Under Software Management, enable Allow Scanning for Known Vulnerabilities in Installed Software. Then, trigger an Inventory and Vulnerability Scan on the Endpoints page or by scheduling a scan for the future. For this video, we will go to the Endpoints page, select the Endpoint, open the Actions menu, and select Scan Inventory and Vulnerability. After the scan completes, you can view the findings by clicking on Vulnerabilities on the left. Here you can filter vulnerabilities by application and severity. Click on the CVE for more details. Below, you will see a list of all endpoints with this vulnerability. Vulnerability assessment will scan for CVEs across all of your endpoints, so you know which doors you need to lock. In a future update, you will also be able to add patch management to your OneView entitlement as an additional subscription, which will allow you to update the software on your endpoints from your console. Patch management allows you to check for available patches for your endpoints to further improve their overall security. If you have any questions, please visit service.malwarebytes.com.